but Nintendo. Welcome back to the channel, guys. We're gonna go old school. We're gonna play some NBA Live 95 on the Super Nintendo. It's been a while since I played this game, guys, so it seemed like the 90s was the golden era of the NBA. It's safe to say it was the golden era in sports, period. Not just saying that because I was born in the 80s and pretty much, you know, grew up around that time period. But if you look back, guys, it's true. We're going to go with the... Let's see what happens. Good play, baby. Good play. Anthony Hardaway. Shaquille O'Neal. I used to play this game so much back in the days. Not as much as NBA Jam, but I played it enough. Anthony Hardaway with the steal. Oh, they got it back. Good dunk by Anthony Hardaway. It was another game I used to play quite often too. Um, it was a uh, Bulls versus Blazers, I think was the name of it. It was a few of them, but those games were pretty good too. Made by EA, of course, back when EA actually made good games. fell off the map pretty much now. I know the Madden series is terrible. I wish we had NFL 2K back. I just miss the days when it was a large uh, variety of different developers making games. Now it's just, you know, a few. When it comes to basketball, you only have 2K. When it comes to football, you only have EA. So. You know, back in the days, you had games by Sega, Acclaim, you know, EA. You had many different options. Man, we on fire. 12, what's that, 2 to 16? Oh man, we on fire. Good dunk by Hardaway. You got to remember guys, around this time, the magic was almost unstoppable. The Bulls was great too, don't get it twisted, you know, with Jordan or whatever, but uh, the magic definitely wasn't no pushover.
The Knicks is all over the place. They're just trying to put some points on the board at this point. Shaq with the jam. They finally made something that was John Starks. Oh. Good dunk, baby. Good dunk. I remember Xbox released a basketball game that was pretty good. Uh, I think it was called NBA Inside Drive. Something like that. It was pretty good. Like I said, guys, I really miss when it was like a large uh, variety of uh, developers making basketball games or football, hockey, you know, whatever. Now it's just the same, you know, two developers making all the sports games. Back in the days, man, I remember from a football standpoint, you had the Joe Montana series, you had Madden, you had Quarterback Club. I mean, it was just so many of them, man. And it made it interesting, you know, you go in the store and you, you know, you'll, you'll test them all out till you find one that you really like. Uh, we're still beating about 20 points. 10 Hardaway for the three, baby. The Magic should have won the championship, guys, but that didn't happen. They had all the pieces. You know, Derek Anderson and, I mean, well, Nick Anderson, I should say. I'm sorry about that, but, I mean, they had the pieces. They had Horace Grant at one point. Shaq. Shaq was like the best player in the NBA around that time. They just couldn't get over the hump. And then, of course, he go to L.A. and win multiple championships there. And in Miami. 37 to 12, guys. 37 to 12. It's all good. Look at that score. Oh, man. They starting to steal everything now. Desperation mode for real. Okay. No, sir. I know you guys, if you guys was raised in the 80s or the 90s, you got to remember music like this, guys. This right here reminds me of an episode of Martin or something.
One thing about this game, it don't say their name. But the numbers are big enough and you can see them clear enough that you know who the players are, especially if you know who they are by their jersey number anyways. Nope. No, sir. Fifty to eighteen, guys. Fifty to eighteen. That shot animation looked very weird, but hey, it'll work. This is 90s basketball, guys. One of the best of his era. These guys is losing by 32 points. Thirty-four points. I'll give him that. That was a good shot. But I can do it better. They're trying to do a little something, but it's a little too late. All right, I see. Okay. I got gotcha. you. Sixty-one to twenty-nine. You guys might as well go ahead and pack your bags. If I was a fan, I'd go ahead and start packing it on up. Look at that. The torture is real, guys. These guys are getting absolutely destroyed. It is embarrassing. Sixty-seven to thirty-one. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this one up, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video, guys. If you guys have any game requests. Leave them down below in the comments. Again, this was NBA Live 95 on the Super Nintendo. Please like, please share, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.